Today we will cover Data Migration Cockpit and its functionality in SAP S4 HANA Cloud. If you are working with data migration or even just a beginner who is learning SAP, this is the topic that you should have good handhold. What are we waiting for? Let's jump into it. Prerequisite since this is advanced topic of S4 HANA, target audience are expected to have knowledge SAP S4 HANA and AK Enterprise Structure, Data Flow, Tables and Fields of FI and CO Area. Introduction Data Migration Cockpit is a tool offered by SAP in S4 HANA to migrate data from SAP AK or non-SAP system. Unlike LSMW in AK, no need to record transaction and fields, fields mapping and then prepare load file structure, it comes with ready-made data load template where fields are already mapped to target fields. LTMC introduced back in 2016, then it was also known by the transaction code LTMC. But from then it has come a long long journey and now the traditional T code LTMC is no more valid, where a Fiori app, Migrate Your Data, app introduced. It is not just UI, user interface, change, but there are lots of standardization done as per current business requirement which we will see in demo today. It is SAP recommended solution that is being used in S4 HANA migration project across globe. Data migration type SAP offers three ways to migrate data. 1. Load data using XMLS template 2. Load data using staging table 3. Load data direct from SAP X system using RFC connection. Starting from 2020, load data using XMLS template merged with load data using staging table. That means when you create projects in Fiori app, migrate your data, system shows only staging table and direct load from AIC. However, once you create project using staging table, then you can download XMLS load template and upload it. Transaction code, LTMC obsolete starting from 2020 release, whatever projects that had been created until 2020 will continue to work on it. However, creation of new projects is not possible. All new projects creation should be done in Fiori app, migrate your data, app available in Fiori. Enter T code LTMC and hit enter, system automatically routes to SAP Fiori server. Now let's see the Fiori app. Log in into Fiori and search for migrate your data app in search bar. Once system shows result, click on the app and get into it. This is how the data migration cockpit, DMC, looks like. Till now, no migration objects are available. It just shows existing projects. Let's now further play with it and create a new project and then select related objects that will be used for data migration. Once you click on the create button, it shows two available options. First, directly from SAP system which requires an RFC connection to be established, and second one is using staging tables. We will select staging table. To edit existing project, select the project by ticking the square box available before project name and then click edit, copy, delete as required. If you want to understand what each field means, select the field and hit F1. System will open package documentation which will help you to understand. Here we updated project name, system automatically populated next available mass transfer ID and select local SAP database schema under database connection and click on step 2. Select local package under development packages and then click on step 3. Now you see, all objects that are supplied by SAP is available here. We need to select relevant objects required by project. Select objects using tick mark checkbox and move to selected objects tray on right side using arrow mark highlighted below. Selected objects are available on the right side under selected migration objects tray. Now click on review and then click on add. Now review page with all details available, in case changes required then click on edit to make changes or click on create project button. Now project is created and available for data migration. Click on the project name and system takes you inside the project where each selected objects are available with status migration not started. System takes some time to prepare standard downloadable template, please wait until project status is ready. Once objects are ready, download template option will appear, now select the object and click on download template and then select XML file to download and open in Excel. XML file downloaded and available in download tray or just above the start button. Open the downloaded XML file. Multiple sheets available in the file, first sheets have a clear overview about file structure. 
where in second sheets outlines available fields and related algorithm, rest all sheets are data entry sheets which are subject to migration. Conclusion, Excel-based data upload is still available. However, in large project where data size is huge, data migration using staging table, boards, is highly recommendable as it can perform extract, transform and load, ETL, that reduce manual effort and increase data quality. Stay tuned for next session where we will cover how to customize, add or delete fields, standard load template and then followed by data load in S4 system. Until then take care, goodbye, like subscribe and share to support the effort that we put behind to share knowledge.